what's going on guys, it's Pixel Place, it's one five here, and today I'm going to be telling you guys how to download custom themes for Discord. Now, as you guys can see on my Discord, um I currently have the regular old dark theme. If I go into um Yeah, it's like if I were to go into like um theme like sorry, appearance, I only have dark and light, right? Well that's all about to change. So, what you want to do is you want to go to, so you actually want to go here, so betterdiscord.net, um, I'll leave the link down in the description below, click on download. Okay, once this, once you click that, it'll bring you to GitHub, what you want to do is go down to either Mac or Windows, I'm using a Windows computer, so you want to click on Windows, alright. Click on that right there. Now it's going to say this because for some reason the latest version is actually not on the GitHub. It'll bring you to like a different thing. Um, so here you go. Right here. So you want to click on install. Do not click repair or uninstall. Just click install. Yup, that all seems right. So just click on install to stable. Click install. And once all of that happens, Discord will open straight up. And next thing you know, you will be here, right? So, I'm just going to go into my uh, my server real quick. Alright, go to user settings. Haha, <laughs> you guys can't see my account. Alright, so, yep, uh -huh, you guys can't see my account. Alright, so... We want to do is scroll down to now you have this section bandaged BD. I scroll down to themes. Now I currently have no themes installed, so I'm gonna go over over to my support server real quick. Um, you want to go to the Better Discord support server. I'll leave a link down in the description below. You want to go to official theme list, and over here you can find a bunch of themes okay or what you can also do is go over here back to Google type in better discord library dot com slash themes again link down in the description below now just for the sake of this tutorial I'm just gonna download clear vision cuz I already did this once and it was actually really cool um so click on download Clear Vision. Uh, it's going to download as a .css file. Okay, there's also um bubbles, black, yeah, black hole. Um, there's a bunch of different ones. There's Earth, uh, Frosted Glass, which is another cool one, and just a bunch more. There's like a One Up Mushroom over here. Um, anime. Super Mario World, so actually, I'll also download that one as well. The Super Mario World, I'll click download. Alright. And I'm just going to scroll down and try to find it. Um, so sometimes it will bring you here if you click on download. So just find which one you wanted. Because that one might not be available anymore. Oh, no, here it is. Click on download. Again, download as a .css file. Alright, go back to Discord, User Settings, go down to Themes, click Open Theme Folder. Okay, so now as you guys can see, I have my Themes folder right here. Just drag and, oops, hold on. So you actually want to drag and drop it to here, to this uh, folder. Alright, so I'm going to do the same thing for the Super Mario World. Boom, they're both in there. You can just go ahead, X that out, and X this out. So now you're back onto Discord. Now, Clear Vision, as soon as you enable that, it'll automatically change. And look how sick this looks, guys. This is my server right now. As you guys can see, this looks different. It just makes everything look so much cooler. Like I downloaded uh this one before. Um I downloaded this one. 
Which is actually, I think the one I'm using, no, this is not the one I'm using right now. That was Midnight UI. But, yeah. So there's that one. And then where you could go, in, and then you could also download, like, plugins. Um, you can make a custom wallpaper, um, different themes. So I'm going to turn that off and turn on the Super Mario World one. And now, yes, it doesn't look as good. Um, but yeah, here, um, there's like the public and then it like kind of like blocks out your, um, these things. I don't know why, like your folders and stuff. Um, I don't really like that. So I'm just gonna go back to user settings, scroll down to themes, go ahead, turn that off. Turn clear vision back on. And there was actually one more that I really like. So I'm going to go back here. And I'm going to go back to the better Discord library. Okay. The one that I liked was called, where is it? Uh, not clear vision. Um, Midnight UI. This one was cool. Just click on download. Um, it's going to do this. That's completely normal there you go all right so now go back to discord open up the themes folder okay now that should be opened up drag and drop that into your themes just like that go here and if nothing pops up do control r to reload discord um it always downloads as a CSS. That's always the theme. Is a CSS. Um, so right now you just got to wait for it to load back up. There you go. Uh, go down to where is theme. Ooh, hold on. Let me just give it some time. Because sometimes it just like freezes a little bit. And now everything will pop up. Um... So, where's themes? User settings. There we go. Okay, themes. If it still doesn't pop up, try opening up the, uh, the thing again. And just try to, like, do that or something. Like, it's... Alright, I don't know why this one's not working well. Um, the Midnight UI, it was working before, but... It's completely fine, guys. Um, but, yeah, so this is how to download themes. So this one I really like. This one I'm probably going to be using a lot. Um, besides the Midnight UI, which I'm going to try to download one more time. Um, I don't know why it did not work. I mean, I know it's definitely in my themes folder, so something's got to be up, but... Yeah, so there's the uh, source code in case you guys want to like edit. Um, there's even like a um, where is it? Like the just plain dark. I just type in dark. Yep, simply dark. Um, this is like the darker mode on mo on uh, Android, except it's just much much darker. <laughs> um. But I can try to find some more that is cool. Um, what's another good one? Another one I like is, where is it? An Orin Deep Field. This one was a cool one. Um, it didn't like really work that well. Um, yeah, it didn't like really work that well. But it still looked good. There's an anti-lag. Um... So it just looks like that. It just looks like a bunch of source codes. Earth is a cool one. Um, I'll go ahead and download that. Halloween version 3 I'll download. Halloween. Um, what else? I think that's everything that I'm going to install. Um, this is cool how you could like choose a portal blue or portal orange. That's cool. Uh, retro, scratched up. Scratched up version 2. So yeah, there's like a bunch of cool ones. So I'm just going to go back here to user settings. 
Streamer mode um does like it blocks out my thing, so go to themes, open theme folder. Alright, you'll see this open up. Um I'm just gonna go ahead and drag everything into the themes folder and there you go. That's all in there. Close that out. Go into Discord and now you guys can see everything is here. So turn off that. Let's just put on Earth. Um, thank you, please enjoy. And then there you go. So here's Earth. Um, there's like the plugin. So I guess um you might need like a certain plugin. This is cool. How like uh you can like put your mouse aside and see everything. Um, a lot of these I actually haven't tried out yet, um, so I'm just going to turn that off. Uh, Halloween, ooh, this one looks cool. Halloween version 3, and then let's take off the Halloween. This one looks cool. I hate how it does this, like, blurs out your folders. Um, that's why I kind of like the other one. That's why I like the clear vision. Um, because it doesn't do that to your folders, it just looks simply awesome. Like, the game that you're playing just goes into, like, a blue kind of thing. Um, since, um, I have, like, an orange roll, if I were to click on this, my name will show up orange. Uh, tree, his will be green. Um, this one will be purple, like a dark maroon. Blue, 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 blue. All these will be yellow. Honestly, it's like really cool um, how like I can do all this. So yeah, I think that's going to be it for this episode. Um, sorry, for this tutorial. If you guys did enjoy, please give a thumbs up. Also, I add adding stuff to my Discord server. Um, now we have a support channel. So you open up a ticket. And the... And then I'll get, sorry, then you'll get pinged, and then the support team will get pinged. Don't worry, I have the support role as well, so I might be able to help. Um, and then once you're all done, only mods, only mods can actually see these tickets, I'm pretty sure. Um, if I go to edit category permissions, yeah, only the support team. At everyone cannot read, but only the support team can. So that's cool, and then I could always just delete the ticket. It'll be deleted in five seconds. Bam, auto deleted. So I'm always adding stuff to my server. Like I said, if you guys did enjoy, please leave a thumbs up. Comment down below what tutorial I should make in the next video, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.